What is up? I'm Moana Turtle, and today we have some more Unified Minds packs. We have, I believe this is nine, yeah, nine packs, and with how how good the pull rates have been, I'm expecting, hoping for at least two big hits. And for, yeah, the Turtle account, we did finally get up to four. Uh, still looking for that reverse. One thing I'm not sure about is how, what's the ratio for getting common, uncommon, and rare or hollow reverses? I'm wondering if it's just like the let's say there's 200 eligible cards if it's just like you have one in 200 shot if you know any details about that or if there's more likely to get common beyond the fact that there's more commons than uncommons uh yeah if you know anything about those ratios let me know because i'm curious about the math and then so i can figure out <laughs> how long it should and then how long it ultimately does end up taking me to pull that reverse tortuga because that is the big prize oh what did i Ooh, yeah, I want a Tortuga. <laughs> May have messed up the intro, but it's too late for that. We got a coach trainer. Draw two cards, okay. Cresselia. Dratini. Still haven't pulled that Dragonite. That's definitely one that we are going for. We got a Yonma. Has, there's a lot of very vanilla cards in this set. Here's kind of like another one. Hunch Crow. Oh no, Murkrow. Ruin red card from opponent's hand. That's not bad for a basic. Ooh, so Valley, very off center. I wonder if this could get a miscut. And it is a reverse rare. Nice. And then we. Ooh, gosh, we pulled that culture trainer and it was kind of interesting. Now we got the full art version of it. That's a that's a solid art right there. I'm not sure who Coach Trainer is. Um, draw two cards. If your active Pokemon is a tag team, draw two more cards in as well. Um, I do feel like. Actually, uh, I've been playing some PTCGO and the the Giratina deck is super annoying. It's just Malamars, Giratinas, and then some people tech in like, the one that was really interesting was the Mimikyu Gengar, and he didn't use the attack, he actually just used the GX. But that was very scary. Um, the, like, at certain times if he used it, he didn't know what I had, but I had full of trainers, and it would have done like massive damage. So, okay, we got a full art right off the bat. Um, you, you know, even if this does is successful, like the draw four cards, obviously it's good, but I feel like there's just better stuff. Like Welder, you know, for the deck that I'm currently running, where you draw three cards, assuming you have a single energy, like that's just, and it does acceleration, that's just leaps and bounds better. Um, you know, st compared to stuff like Cynthia and Lily, I think that one has just, you see more cards. Like, sometimes you might not net as many like you don't net any as many new cards net new cards but the fact that you just see all different ones you know it does take at make that one a little bit better but uh for our first pack you know that's like that's a great pull right there uh yeah for nine packs we are on track to having that awesome opening we got a flyingium z air slash blizzard town 40 or less damage hmm i wonder if there's a way to use that for mantis oh and dream leak the is it the there's one card that zap to that brings your opponent down to 10 health Ooh, that's another good one it's uncommon nice misty's favor for the reverse and then we have oh my gosh what is this opening we got another uh great hit a full art this is not the best that's this is this one's not bad like isn't rowlet like taking a picture with his butt <laughs> Well, actually, this art has this card has awesome art. This one is pretty funny. The alternate art I find is a little bit funnier because it's like, where's Waldo? But man, that's a great pull right there. And I did face that card one time in PTC Joe, but uh, considering that was fire, you know, I did was able to dispatch it with that without any issues. But uh, all right, super solid hits. No Tortugas yet. Actually, even our reverse slot, despite not getting any Tortuga, our pretty uh pretty good hits as well so definitely doing well in this opening do me a favor hit that like button down below we got a jinx dragonair delmise hoot hoot scraggy numble tynamo a poiple seeing a lot of those lately oh a ranguru wish this was as good as the other one all these cards are very off center and then a whimsicott so i really want to play the Wimscott deck. People have Tekken one of these. When you play this Pokemon from your hand, evolve it. 
You may search your deck for a card and put it into your hand. Okay, so it's kind of like Red's Challenge uh, from Evolution. Let me just make sure I don't have any. Man, that would be insane if I miss a Tortuga. All right, three packs in, third of the way through, and getting monster hits. No turtles, but still got time. While like the chance of getting like a GX or better every single pack is not high, the chance of getting a Tortuga every single pack is always there. It's always consistent, always low apparently. <laughs> we got a Hapu, seeing a little bit of this. Magneton, and then Sableye for the uncommon. So no turtles again. For Mantis, Riolu, Purloin, Joltik with some kind of printing defect, a Marini for the reverse, this one's just a common, and then a Dragonite. Man, how do we get, I want this card very similar, but the GX. I want this thing to say 270. I have not seen that card much. That's definitely one I want to make work as well, but I think my dragon account is zero. Definitely a little slow to get the cards I need. In fact, the deck that I'm running is a. Uh, ooh! Close, close, close. Wrong turtle. But we will put you in the background for now, although we're not, not searching you out as much. Yan Mega, Dredagon, Shroomish, Drifloom, a Dewpider. Cryo, cryogonal, <laughs> a Cubone with no fighting energies, and then a Weavile GX. Man, this is an insane opening. What do you do? What else do you like? Oh, you can move these things around. Search your deck for a number of basic Pokemon. Put them onto your bench. Hmm. No, thank you. All right, we still got some packs left. Three hits so far, man. Even if we got no more hits, like 30, you know, 33% hit rate, that's insane. With one of them being a full art, or a full art Pokemon, and then a full art trainer. We got Pokemon Research Lab, Luminion, ah, normal, normalium, <laughs> Alolan Grimer, Carablast, Fletchinder, Fletchling, Hone Edge, a pretty cute Pikachu, a Young Goose, this Pokemon looks so weird, and then a Alolan Marowak, Smash Smash, discard the top of your opponent card, discard, ooh man, hmm, if you know how to make this card work, let me know, that thing would be insane, just uh, oh here's a tag team on the top of my deck, boom, instant knockout, no energy required, yeah there's no like, in magic like scrying things in Pokemon Go, is there? It's kinda of, I think it was like um uh was it like Pokedex or something where you kinda of like look at five cards and you rearrange them any way you want. I'm not sure if there's any equip very similar things to that in in standard right now. Dredagon, Shroomish, Drifloom, Dewbiter, if you can think of one though, let me know. Cryogonal. Lucario with Gertina and Garchomp in the background. Very nice. And then a Talon Flame for our regular rare. All right, three hits, one incorrect turtle. We got the uh, Bane Turtle. Not the cute sea turtle that we're looking for. Oh, and uh, I did drop a Pokemon Masters video where I kind of rate the turtles in the game right now. Currently, they stink but but there is some huge potential in one of them if you haven't seen that yet go check it out especially if you're in, if you are playing the game or interested in playing the game i think one of them could be super relevant come whenever pvp drops depending on how they implement it look how off cut these off center these cards are and then a rare we do have although like the hollow so this probably comes from a different sheet this one's not as bad electros we're concerned if this pokemon is in your hand you have at least four electric energy cards in play bench if you do wait what you may play this pokemon onto your bench Ooh, so that means you don't need to evolve it hmm interesting that's not bad don't think it's good enough but it's very interesting it has some different mechanics which i do appreciate 
like based on what I what I just read, I, I think I might be able, you might be able to use it without actually having the evolution steps for it. Lampant. That being said, it just might not be strong enough. <laughs> Reloom. Dark City. My cards are falling all over the place. Alright, this is our last pack. Can we get some last pack magic? Sunfisk. Onyx, that's a cool art. Finian, starting to catch a lot of those. Karate Belt. And a camera. So, no dice there. Uh, we didn't get any. We got one Bane Turtle, but none of the other ones. So, our... Tortuga count did not increase, however, it was still a pretty insane opening. We got three big hits. We have a Weavile. Uh, this one's not huge, but very nice card. This one I am a fan of. The art of this card is on point. Growlit taking a picture with his butt. And then a full art trainer. Pretty cool one. Coach trainer. Draw two cards. If your opponent has a tag team, draw two more. So, uh, there you guys have it. Uh, very successful opening, I would say. Still looking for them Tortugas, but we're going to keep plugging away at it, see if we can't get more of them. Uh, but that's it for today. As always, thanks for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe down below. I'm a Wanted Turtle. Oh, I'm a Wanted Tortuga. And I'll catch you guys next time.